Hey guys, it's a beautiful summer day here in the north today, I tell ya. Uh, the date today, June 12th, 2020, I believe. Uh, what I'm up to today, you say, well, today, I'm just hanging out with my father here. We're out at camp. What we're doing here, we got a moose hide. We're gonna make raw hide with this. This moose hide I had <coughs> soaked in the river for about 10 days. And the reason for that is to get it the hair to slip so what we're gonna do we're gonna pull we're gonna put it up on a pole and then we're gonna pull all the hair out and scrape all the hair out and then uh, we'll put it on a stretcher and let it dry and then well we'll end up with rawhide so uh, it's pretty simple pretty straightforward so this moose here <clears throat> this is a moose that I had throughout all last winter uh, I salted it and fleshed it you know exactly for this project the last couple times I wanted to do this, the first time I uh, I had the hide thrown in the river and tied on a big long log while the water rose up and my log drifted away with my hide. And the second time I went to attempt this, uh, my hide again was in the river and, and a black bear came and, and packed my hide off and, and that was the end of that. So uh, this hide here, we're going to string it up and uh, well, we'll start pulling hair off it. Okay guys. Let's get the party started. This is gonna be fun. You ready? Let's give her. Right on. How's it coming out? Yeah, it's coming. I'm not sure what it's supposed to come like. You got a you have yeah. a flushing bone? I do, yeah. I got my flushing I think you take the flushing bone and just I think pull it down. So all his hair has gotta come out. As you can see it's coming out pretty nicely. I think once you get it started, it should be, well, kind of like, oh, you got her there. Mm -hmm. So now this rawhide, after it's, <clears throat> after we get all the hair pulled out, we'll put it on a stretcher. And like I was saying before, we'll let it dry. And then there's all types of stuff you could do with it afterwards. That's one of the steps to making, to tanning it and to making it leather, into leather. So, but this won't be turned into leather. I got plans for a few projects for this but uh, we'll talk more about that a little later maybe if it sat in the water for a few more days it might come out easier i don't know i salted it so it's not rotting it's got a little bit of a stink to it but not too bad not too bad at all not bad huh it's not even rotten it's not. Oh, yeah it's just, it smells like moose Fucking stuck in there good though. Oh, like mud in the river. This is probably gonna take a few hours, I would think. Get this done and then we'll go fishing. Rudy. What are you doing, Rudy Rudy? Rudy is six months, two days old. Hey Root. Huh? Good boy, Rudy. So some of these hairs come out a little bit better than the others. Some will come out in big chunks and some are really stuck on. Why that is, I'm not too sure. Salt. Dad figures it was how I salted it. Too much salt and... <laughs> salt probably preserved the roots, eh? So, well, last fall when I salted it, we knew that it was gonna be a this summer project, so I didn't want it to go bad and rot, huh? Yeah. Because no one wants to be working with a rotten old uh, hide. Like right now it doesn't stink, it just yeah, smells cool. like a moose head, smells actually, mm -hmm. smells good actually. <laughs> yeah. Sure. But anyways, so some are coming out quicker and some are easier. So as you can see with dad scraping that spot there, it's tough. It's real tough. Like here, this yeah, tough, I was grabbing big chunks and they're just coming out. Yeah, see like that. Probably more soaking would give us a torch. I think Hang it on needs, a time crunch, so. I think it needs a little more soaking. We'll take off whatever we can and then well, we'll just see. What are you doing? Huh? What are you doing, Groot? Rudy, Rudy. Rudy, Rudy, Rudy. <coughs> okay, settle down. This is Groot. It's coming along slowly. Looking pretty good. How's it coming out, part dad? Yeah, this is really coming off easy. 
about half done, just about. Yeah, over half now. Over half. Oh yeah, looking good. What did that take? Six hours? Yeah, a good six hours. A good six hours. It's all flush now. Hair's all off. Now that will go on a stretcher, but that will be for another day. Doesn't look too bad, huh? Yeah, I think we have to wash it again, get the mud off from what was in the river. That's on the dirty part. Or it wasn't flush. There's nothing to flush there, right? I don't want to touch it. I just wash my hands. That yeah, looks good. Well, it's a hell of a lot lighter than it was now. A lot of hair there. Get out here and let it frickin' drop another 10 pounds of water. Or 20 pounds of water just sitting in the sun there. It's soap safe, it's saturated. Oh yeah. So now this will get put on a stretcher just like you'd stretch any uh, bear hide or anything. It'll be on a frame and it'll be lashed on with, uh, with rope or twine or whatever. End up with some good raw hide. <coughs> That's for another day project and uh, I'll keep you guys posted on how this turns out.